Hi! I am writing a movie. I'm writing a movie. <laughs> you are? Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. What's it about? Um, okay, well, it's, a, it's an adaptation of my favorite book. So it's like not my idea, but it was my idea to make it a movie. Like, write it, so. What book is it? Uh, The Pigman? Pigman? The Pigman, written by Paul Zindel, first published in 1968, chronicles the unlikely friendship between two high school sophomores, John Conlon and Lorraine Jensen, and the eccentric Angelo Pignati, an old, lonely man they convinced to donate $10 to their fake charity through a prank phone call. The Pigman unfortunately missed the angst-filled classes of the millennial generation entirely, and the idea that there are people, young people, walking around completely unaware of the literary existence of John Conlon and Lorraine Jensen terrifies me. They jump off the page in their honest entirety, the relatable, emotional, and real, or at least they should be. I relate to Lorraine's compassion and caution and John's wit and good looks. Actually, I probably re relate to Lorraine more on that one. But uh, damn, yeah, yeah, John's supposed to be John's supposed to be pretty, pretty goddamn hot. I mean, like whoever plays John and whoever plays Lorraine, like there should definitely be a sweet old love scene. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> But I don't, you know, I, I don't know, I don't know who John would be. I definitely haven't fantasized or planned that at all. And and like, like John would just like lean into Lorraine, whisper in her ear, like, I, I love you so much, Haley or Lorraine or whatever. Um, this book came to me in an act of complete fate and destiny. I don't know why or how I came across it. All I know is that it's changed me. Huh? Uh, it does say it belonged to my cousin in the seventh grade, uh, but she lives in Florida. How would I have gotten it? Like, whoa, nice throw, cuz, thanks for the book. Um, and grade seven, she would have been in 2005. Uh, nope, uh, don't remember her visiting 2005, so, <laughs> fate. And so I wrote, and I wrote, and suddenly I found myself in the home stretch. How did this happen so quickly? Did it come too easy? It's almost like it was written out for me or something, and how do I know it's any good? Although I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. But you know, if, if I did get this book from Raimi, I figure I should probably call her and thank her for showing me my purpose or whatever, so. Yes, yes, so that's what's happening! <laughs> yeah, so I just wanted to call you and, I don't know, thank you? I must have like, I don't know, I must have like taken it from Wait, you or something. I remember that book. Yeah, I failed that book report because I thought I'd lost it. I was grounded for two weeks! Haley, what the f- You know, you seem a little confident about this. Oh, fudge. What do you mean? Uh, unfortunately, the state is not looking to do anything to film my stupid Shit! Shit! <laughs> I'm a failure. I, I gotta get out of here. I can't show my face here. I gotta go. I can't be seen here. I can't show my face in this town again. Oh man, I gotta get out of here. There's no way I am showing my face in this town again. Are you coming? I gotta go. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Well, I gotta go. Okay. Well, don't eat those anymore. Right? All right. Let's go. What? <laughs> you look like a, like you did when you were four. I feel like a, a child. You're a little child. I feel like a child. Who What's needs that, little baby girl? What's my purpose? Hey, you're the bad luck baby. Shut your umbrellas, kids, and don't follow your dreams. Because <laughs> it's just going to rain on you. So maybe open them. Open your umbrellas. And get ready for the storm. Show my face. Start again. Show my face. How's it going up there? Yeah, super. Okay. So, um, did you want to 
of like Venmo me, like for gas or oh or yeah, just like yeah, yeah, kind of like I have like or... you have like a toonie, mm -hmm. a what? Paul Zindel found his own personal pig man very early on in his life, so maybe that's what I needed to do. I just needed to go out and find my pig man, whoever or whatever that may be. Perhaps they or it are in Los Angeles? Joanna and I have our first big meeting today, so I thought I'd, you know, let them know that I'm let them know, <laughs> you know, it's a, uh, I think I got this one in the bag. I think they're gonna love it. So to speak, got a, got a few uh, tricks up my sleeve. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> like, um, excuse me, I know where we are and I know where I'm gonna be. Um, excuse me, when someone says, where do I live? I'll just say, excuse me, look uh, at her shirt. Check the shirt, honey! <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're gonna love it, they're gonna love it. <laughs> they're gonna love us. Yeah, because I love us. B. Oh, gross. Finally. Um, at the moment, we're just not really looking to look at any more projects, but, you know, we'll be in touch. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and he killed it. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Round of um, it's kind of, this song's called Remove Tag, and it's, uh, well, it speaks for itself. <laughs> Not like a skin tag or anything. <laughs> I was like, maybe it doesn't. <laughs> She lives in a loft. Oh, this is where I'm living. <laughs> this is where I'm living. <laughs> yes. Oh shit. Look at this. Oh yeah, we got that pillow stuffing, that fiber fill, honey. Steps onto my bed. This is where I'm sleeping. Rest my head. And that's where Vale sleeps, and she hears me crying. Okay, we got the wardrobe. Uh, it's looking fresh when your wardrobe looking shitty. <laughs> I mean, good. <laughs> Ready and slip. This is my goddamn desk. Uh, someone gave me those two items at a recent meetup, and I agree. We got the essentials. You know what's up. Thinking of. Got a text. I got a text, and what a good segue into the kitchen. Beautiful view. 
Oh, what up, girl? So, this is what it looks like to be me at this time, right now. Um, feels good. You know, I'm waiting for the dread to sink and like, yes, I'm living in LA. I'm living with two beautiful dogs and a wonderful creative roommate. And yeah, I might get a tan and yes, I'm taking bonfire IGs, but like at what cost? When's it going to feel like it wasn't worth it? You know what I'm saying? It's like, when am I going to feel like, oh, I want to hate, I want to go back. <laughs> I want to hate myself. I don't want to hate myself. That just happens. But you know, it's like, when am I going to, when am I going to feel like maybe you know, people come to LA and they're like, it's gonna be great, and then, it's not. <laughs> so I guess I'm just waiting for that. Thank you. Yeah, it's a little terrifying. It's a little terrifying. <laughs> Are you recording? Are you recording? No. Alright. I just don't want to be on the camera right now. Yeah. Yeah, god damn it. Is it recording? Yeah, fucking shit. I don't see a red light. Yeah. Or it's behind on the camcorder. It's right here. Ah. I like these. Yeah. Welcome to my house. This is where Haley spends most of her time. Right. At my fucking house. <laughs> my apartment. Um, this is where she puts her shoes every single time, even though I always tell her this is not a no shoe. Yeah, can you please take your shoes off, please? This is not a no shoe. These are my house shoes. This is not a no-shoe household, but she did bring her own, and then she also borrowed mine. They're nice shoes. Yeah. This is a cat. This one is diabetic. The other one is not. We have one diabetic, one non. One regular. This is where Haley comes in and then just like spits food all over the place, and then my cat later eats it, even though my cat has diabetes, and I keep telling her like, don't leave your fucking chips out. And then Wizard, like all of a sudden we just hear him like and I'm like, oh, what's that, a fucking chip? This is her coffee, she never finishes. She's always just like about two inches of coffee left. I just got this pillow. Haley noticed right when she walked in. Like a good she, friend. First time here, she came in and went, new pillow! <laughs> like what? <laughs> new pillow! That's what she did. No pillow! She's even got food in the goddamn freezer. No, I ate it today. Okay, she ate it. This is where she first learned how to put on perfume for the first time. Oh. Taught her. This was Can her you please first. demonstrate it? Hold on, yes. let's see the light. I'm just like... Um, we've been having a great time. This is where we work. This is where we do... All the... Small things. This is where we do all the work. Okay, what to say? Should I just get inside this cat house? <laughs> this is a funny gag. This is funny. Well, it's like, well, she's not a cat. Because we're barely asleep. Oh. <laughs> no, in all seriousness, this this is where I live. What's in here? What can I just see? What's in here? Oh yeah, these are just like. What are these moisture, like facial samples? Like you know how you go to the drugstore and they give you moisturizer no, this samples? This is just like a drunk drawer. This is where I just keep like you what know are these? like what are these? lifestyle. Yeah, so it's like moisturizer or like a lot. Must like, have really dry skin. <laughs>
Does this thing work anymore? Is this thing on? <laughs> You're in LA now. What you have do? to hold down that button. Mm hmm. Hold it down. All right, hold down that. LA initiation? Yeah. Hold down that button. Okay. Now suck in and keep holding it down. And you just smoked PCP. How do you feel? Well, <laughs> I do declare. <laughs> Oil. I to get really honed. What? No, there's no drugs in that. What's the point? <laughs> Is when you put it on, Mom? My mom never showed me. Five stars of the rich and famous. They're always complaining. Should you take a boomerang of me like... Make it 100%. Like, stop this right now. That's more important. Sasha. Hi. Sasha. Hi. Welcome to Friday Night In. That's fucked up that I'm just mm -hmm. let off with a warning because right. my dad did something cool. Right. My dad yeah. showed me all of his movies when I was about five years old. Are there any movies? Jaws. Where he's like, next. Including and Schindler's next. List. Yeah. <laughs> no. Does anyone, like, what do you think that LA has to offer? Mm. I don't feel like there's anything special about it. About LA, yeah. I mean, it really, really doesn't. Mean. Like, there's really nothing. You know, it's like, yeah, cotton candy skies. Yeah, skyline. I mean, like, yeah, yeah we're fine. in the hills. Sure. So we're in Whatever. the Whatever. Asshole. I smoke. What? I smoke. What do you mean? I don't get Whit. it. Wit. We've got Whitmer Thomas. Yeah, Wit. I want to make a movie or a TV show where everybody's name is Chris. Woker. <laughs> that you're like, don't, sh I don't need you to shave. No, I don't care at all as long as I have a perfect body.